When you're working in the medical field, we don't have the privilege of extra time. But we have to remember that we're dealing with sick people. I don't think they would trust caregivers who look sicker than them. So I came up with this quick and easy tutorial that will give you a very natural, long-lasting and healthy glow. Dark circles under the eyes from lack of sleep is inevitable in the medical field. I have used Garnier Brightening Eye Roll-On for years now and it has proven to be effective. I usually apply this at night before I go to bed. I have very oily skin, so I need a stronger type of toner which is an astringent. This closes the pores to prevent over secretion of our oil glands, and it also removes extra dirt in our face. Apply this in an upward motion to prevent dragging our skin down. Wait for it to dry and sink in our pores. You will feel your face getting tighter after a few seconds. Using strong toners can sometimes trick our face to thinking it's too dry. Therefore, it secretes even more oil than usual. Moisturizing the face will balance everything and prevent this from happening. Apply using long massaging strokes to promote circulation. Tap your face a little bit and wait for the greasy feeling to subside. Or apply lip balm. This prevents chapping by locking in moisture in our lips, making it more plump and healthy looking. Concealing is my best friend. It will cover any imperfections in our face. Focus on the edges of your dark circles and blend it well. Using your fingers while doing this will warm the cream and prevent that cakey look, and will smoothen any creasing. It's better to use a lighter shade of concealer for your dark circles to brighten up the face. Cover up any redness around the nose and pigmentation around the lips. Set everything with your pressed powder. Apply using a patting motion. Don't forget to include your neck. Groom your brows and fill them in as necessary. You can use a pencil liner or a brow cake. Just make sure you apply it evenly so it will look natural. Setting your eyebrows with an eyebrow powder will make it last longer, even if you are sweating. Use a cream blusher to give that glowing look and set it with a pink blush. This will give you a very natural, healthy looking flush to the face. It's not overdone and it's not lacking. Blend very well so there are no harsh edges.
Curl your lashes to open up your eyes. Applying primer will give it an extra curl and will evenly separate them so when you apply your mascara it won't look clumped. Tight lining your upper lash line will give the illusion of thicker lashes. Placing a white eyeliner on your waterline will give you a very awake look and accentuates the eyes, making it look bigger and brighter. Tinted lip balms will give your lips a natural color and moisturizes it at the same time. They also last longer without having to do touch-ups. And that's your look! Now you're ready to brighten up a patient's day. Subscribe for more videos, follow me on Twitter, and check out my site. Till next time!